Well, in the last four months, I had a chance to go to China on an internship, and I worked for a company called Wizard English uh, Conversation over the summer. I went with a friend of mine, Philip, and whenever we got to China, we were informed that we would be working for Wizard as the marketing team. So Philip and I, each day, we would um, first we would start out translating uh, some of the books that were only in Chinese, and we would translate them to English. And after that, we would have the opportunity to go out down into the streets and to talk to the people and share with them the the business. Philip and I had the chance to to have summer camps for some of the smaller children that wanted to learn English and so we would bring them up to the company's office and for the whole day Philip and I would have a chance to do some English games and and have a chance to show the the smaller children what English was the English business was all about as we worked at Wizard we had a lot of great success there and we even had the chance to um, give trainings as Philip and Xiaorong and I and uh, and also Hannah another sister from here the four of us as we showed them uh, our work ethics and how we really desired to help the business grow. They really enjoyed that and so we got to give sharings and trainings to the business and they invited us back and they said as soon as we have the chance and we graduate they'd like to have us back. So a friend of ours, Xiaorong, she was a part of the internship with us. She knew that Philip and I were political science majors and we wanted to uh, study a little bit more about Asia and so one of our main areas of interest is uh, North Korea and so Xiaorong gave us the opportunity to go up to the border of North Korea and China and to be right at the very edge. And I mean, we're talking, there was a little creek in between China and North Korea and there was a bridge and a little tiny village that had, uh, I think, one or two places to eat at. And uh, I don't think people had ever seen a white person before. So for me, I'd learned a lot of things about North Korea and some of the leaders and the decisions that they've made. Um, when we looked across the water and just kind of put our hands up and waved those children, they smiled so bright and they started waving back to us and jumping up and waving and just, um, it, to me at that point I realized that the light of Christ is in everyone and it doesn't matter uh, the, the leaders or the people in the world that make decisions, we're all born with that light of Christ and I thought that was a special thing for me to see.